The first thing to do now that we have a project open is to bring your 3D model into Lumion. Lumion supports the most common CAD and BIM software file types as shown here in our knowledge base article. So how do we bring the model into Lumion? One way is to import it manually. We select the imported models category and the place command. This will open the imported models library. Ours is empty for the moment, but let's see how to change that. Click on the import button and navigate to your model file location. If it is not visible, make sure that the file type is selected from the drop down menu on the bottom right. Once we have selected the desired model, we will get the import model menu with some additional options. Here we can give our model a specific name, assign it to a folder, or create a new one. This is handy to keep your imported model categories organized. There are also some advanced option toggles available for importing certain animation types, edges or lines for models that have them, and making the model double-sided, which can sometimes resolve modeling issues, but will make the model heavier, so use it with caution. Selecting OK will kick off the import process. And just like that, we have our model in the scene. Now, let's delete it so we can go through the second import method, the recommended one for all the CAD suites that have live sync. Here, we have the file in SketchUp, with LiveSync installed open at the same time as Lumion. To import the model, all we need to do is hit the play button. One thing to be aware of, if Lumion is not open when you do this, the model will be imported to a new plane project. Once it is imported, you will have a live connection that will display your changes to the model in real time. This is a great way to have instant visual feedback about your design. If you need to relink the model or have made changes, the process is the same for both import methods. If the file name and location is the same as previously used, simply click the reimport button. If the file is stored in another location or the name has changed, hold the Alt key and navigate to the new file. Easy. 